I'm Cody Chinnam. I'm the number one ranked wrestler at 145. I found wrestling at the age of nine, and one of my biggest influences was uh, my dad. And funny story, uh, one of my first uh, preseason tournament, Iowa Nationals, uh, we were in the airport and we weighed in and I was 0.2 over for my weight class. And my dad told me I had to skip a meal. So I started crying in the airport and my dad started laughing at me and he goes, we'll just bump up instead. So we get to the, like, the tournament and instead of going to my weight class, I just bumped up and wrestled and made the semis. But... I lost to uh, a girl and got majored by her. She's pretty good. Her name's Kenny Blades. I thought it was a big deal, but my, my dad was like, yeah, she's too experienced. She's too good for you. What I love about the sport is that it's a, it's a combat sport. It's a fight. So it's just you and the other person and you can control almost all of what you can do on the mat and how you can outwork the person. You can outwork them in the room or off the mat and like impose your will on them as well. I'm a brawler on the mat. I like to uh, have my hands in the guys and uh, like it's all business on the mat. So I go out there and just try to rack up some points and have fun while I'm doing it. Wrestling Blair's schedule was pretty tough, especially in the beginning coming from Tennessee having just one to two hard tournaments to every weekend we had a hard tournament. It was a, it was a different adjustment, especially coming from a different type of, different type of like wrestling aspect. And uh, in the beginning I get adjusted to it, but you will be get adjusted to the practice room because the practice room is almost like tournaments every weekend. So I just got myself prepared for the practice room and then in the matches it just came a little bit easier. My dad has done a lot for me, especially when I was little and throughout the years. And he's just been like, he's always been probably the best coach for, not just for me, but just as a role model as well. Just like having him around as a coach and a dad is sometimes hard, but it's probably the easiest thing because you can go to him about anything and there's no like right or wrong. He'll just help you no matter what and you'll get the hardest and you'll get the most truthful judgment and especially in tournaments and matches even if you don't want it you I, I, i'm thankful for him to be there working with dan was really fun especially uh a lot of the hard goes we would get after it a lot and it was uh very fun with just how the intensity was in each practice it would go from zero to hundred real quick. And we would just hand fight and just beat by each other. And, I would, and we would both love it at the same time. I then got one takedown on him, but I got thrown right to my back when I got a takedown. So I don't know if I count that, but my, in my heart I count it. My full name's Lucas Dakota Chittum, but we go by our middle name and my parents don't want me to go by Dakota. So my, for Dakota, like Dakota is short, Cody is short for Dakota. So, uh, in tournaments, especially this year, they put my real name at Blair as Lucas Chittum, and I, I think that they put all my other tournaments as Lucas Chittum as well. So it was a little weird when they said like uh, Lucas on mat five, and we're like, that's not me. And then they said like Chittum, when I'm like sprinting to the mat. So it, it was a little weird at first, but everyone was like, dude, is that you or is that Cody? Like I was like, yeah, it's me. Sorry. I'm Cody Chim, and watch me on track wrestling this season.